safe. Wide range of output voltage, 5, 9, 12, 16, 19 for this right in here. And now you can see that this little LED is kind of going like it's charging. Uh, Hey guys, welcome to another video, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at RAV Power's Extreme Series Power Bank, um, and this is going to be part three in a series of survival and tech, outdoor tech gear. Now, not so much outdoors with this one, but definitely on the survival lines, because this has 23,000 milliamps of power. Uh, if you're going to want any kind of electricity or juice when you uh, are out, camping, hiking, whatever, maybe you're just in a power outage from a, from a natural disaster, this baby will do it. This will power a laptop as well. So if you need a laptop uh, to access something, you're going to be able to do that with this, one of the unique features of this power bank. Um, so let's take a look at it again. I already mentioned that it is 23,000 milliamps, and you can 500 recharges, more than 500 times to recharge this bad boy. Let's flip it over on the back, not upside down. As you can see, Fit4, notebook, tablet, mobile phone, MP3 players, PSPs, um, all sorts of game, uh, gaming devices. Um, stream capacity, we already mentioned that. Uh, it's got a lithium polymer battery, which is stable and safe. Wide range of output voltage, 5, 9, 12, 16, 19, 20, fit for most notebooks, tablets, smartphones. Smart LCD display to show the voltage and how much power you have left automatically on and off make your simple uh, life simple and it's got built-in security protection designed for short circuits and overcurrent protection so you're not going to risk your devices with this it's got a lot of uh, safety measures built in uh, as you can see there's the battery icon USB output power icon capacity and output voltage all of this is on the LCD screen uh, so let's just go ahead and open this up and take a look what all you get in this and you get quite a bit this is definitely one of the coolest chargers to get just for all the adapters and stuff you're going to get with this which is going to make this really handy like I said in the case of an emergency so let's go ahead and open this up see what all you get of course I think I opened it kind of upside down but uh, so you get a nice little uh, carry case for this so you like I said you want to be mobile you've got to have something to carry it in get a nice little instruction booklet and then actual wall charger to charge this bad boy uh, you're gonna have some adapters for different countries there's where you're gonna plug it in and as I mentioned here is one of your adapters for the US uh, another cable here barrel cable and then you've got all sorts of adapters in here for it um, USB barrel cable types there's the old uh, Apple Apple pin connector there, and then just a, just a multitude of different barrel types here, uh, especially like for notebooks. You really need these for different kind of notebooks and stuff. Uh, so this is going to juice quite a bit of stuff. We'll set that aside, and then the actual charger itself, huge. Oh, got another little uh, micro USB adapter down here. That is everything you get in the box, so let's go ahead and get the box out of here and we're going to take a look at this brick of a power charger here and get this box all broken down and out of the way. Alright, so here it is, the RAV Power Extreme Power Bank. This model number is RPPB14 and again, check the show notes, I'll have a link for that. Um, really nice design here got a really nice look to it very glossy black finish on the back if you can see it's got a little bit of information here there's the model number I just mentioned the extreme series the capacity uh, the input and the output and USB 2 5 volts and 2.5 amp and then there are all your DC's that it's got and I, we've mentioned that already it's got a bunch because uh, this has got a bunch of uses so here are some power banks, USB, and as you look down here, here's input, DC output, USB 1 and USB 2. Um, and not a lot of more information on that except uh, that. So let's go ahead and power this on and we'll take a look at the digital display. If I can get it just right and maybe we can zoom in here. Uh, and it went out. So there's the battery. Pretty much out of the box, you've got a pretty good about three-fourths charge. 
and like I said, 81 percent and 20 volts is uh, what we have here so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pause this video and we're gonna hook this up to some devices here real quick and we're gonna go over how it's gonna charge I do want to demonstrate the case so as you can see here this is the carry case that it comes with and I guess it's gonna go in like this and all right maybe it doesn't go in like that well we'll look at the case here in just a little bit uh, and see how this goes but uh, definitely got a little nice little carry case for it and uh, this should work. oh here we go this has got room for other stuff we'll slide it in here so and then we just do this I can get it to so there's your nice little carry case I was trying to put it in the pouch in the back so if you wanted to you could actually keep your phone in this like so and uh, carry this with you there we go so nice little presentation there very portable and and well done so anyway guys we'll be right back we're gonna hook this up and demonstrate its abilities and go from there we'll be right back all right guys welcome back um, as you can see I've plugged this in and it's actually charging it's at 78 percent um, actually now it's turned off but if I just plug this in here to the you want to make sure you're putting in the right thing and this is the input so we go ahead and put this right in here and now you can see that this little LED is kind of going like it's charging uh, at 77 percent I've also got this Kindle Fire HD which is completely dead um, so I'll just unplug that and this will not turn on it is totally dead so then we just sim simply plug this into the charge port now as you can see it's starting to charge and you got a little bit of red battery down here to, to uh, indicate that it's charging so now we're charging and this is uh, the USB 2 is your best one for tablets uh, over here you can see it's got two one is a one amp one is a two amp so you want to go with the one that's going to do the best you know use the Sm uh, smaller one for the phones and the other ones for the tablets so I'm actually trying to use the USB 2 to get a little more uh, output um, into this tablet to charge it a little bit faster well, let me go ahead and unplug this so I'm not tethered over here to my cable um, one thing um, hopefully I can get this in the view here if you hold this in it's going to tell you I'm, I'm outputting 9 volts uh, so if I go to the output of this to try to power a notebook I can actually change this up by holding this button in and now it's flashing so I can go to 12 volts 16 volts 19 volts 20 volts and back to 9 so I do have options on uh, regulating the voltage that this takes uh, for a size let me go ahead and show you a comparison here is a Kindle Fire HD as you can see not a lot of size difference between the two so if you're looking for how big this is that's a good comparison here is an iPhone 6 not a 6 plus fits inside of this so it is a little bit big but you know you're gonna pack this away in your little uh, travel pouch and you should be good to go um, other than that this again has all the security protections to uh, make sure you don't fry any of your gear uh, and again it comes with so many different adapters if you uh, don't have an adapter here that you can use I, I would be surprised because this covers a lot of gamut of stuff uh, and you can actually use this to power stuff so um, you know it doesn't have to be a charging thing if you can run it off of like it's plugged into the wall find the adapter and you can use this to actually power devices out and about um, when you need them so it's juice on the go as well again uh, a lot of different adapters with this uh, and I will have a link in the show notes where you can pick one of these up uh, definitely one of these uh, something you don't want to be without um, for this much juice that it's got and so many different uses you don't want to be without this uh, and have no electricity this will get you through times of emergency times of need really cool device highly recommend it wrap power is quality behind them and you can't go wrong so if you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up and a subscription to the channel. And as always, hit that like button, share it, and subscribe. And thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.